first fish in the boat. Smoked it, dude. Yeah. Jeez. Ooh, that feels pretty good. Talking about these fish being timid of big baits. This is a pretty good indicator that if they're hungry, they're going after it. That's so funny. You think that big one was a nine? Get out of here. That was legit. Oh, grab it, grab it, jump in. What's going on, y'all? Welcome back to the channel. We're starting things off at Guggen HQ today. We're grabbing the hot tamale, the bass boat, headed down to Austin for a fun weekend of fishing with Devin and myself. Hopefully get out with some of our buddies down there. Oh, That's not much better. Flawless. Tag along, it's gonna be a lot of fun. We'll see you down south. I'm sure what can happen. And again, we don't have y'all we made it down to Austin we are on Lake Travis for day one just an afternoon sesh uh, the lake looks extremely low and uh, oh I see you you're checking out our new transom saver for the first time y'all check this out that's it this is it so nope. a lot of y'all are probably used to this style transom saver regardless but it's new to us because we again just had that cheap one that came with this boat these guys you can kind of lock them on here clamps this way your motor doesn't shift left to right the whole point of this y'all is just so that your motor's not shaking around like crazy with our last one it would also like shift while we were driving like go left or go right and it's just not good for the motor pups are also joining us y'all and we're about to launch this thing we'll see y'all on the water a lot of rocks right here y'all you don't want to gun it in reverse <laughs> and uh have the prop be the first thing that hits these. What's going on, Zeke? Are you uh, you narrating today? Here we are, y'all. Starnes Island, right here at the mount. Side scan, seeing if we uh, see anything other than rock. And if we do, we're gonna crank it, jerk bait it, have some fun with some swim baits, work our way maybe through that marina for a moment, and just hit every secondary point all the way back from where we launched. It was probably a 10 minute run. We were just modest paced out here with the pups on board. Anyways, I should probably focus on the screen. Let's see if we can find some fish. There's a fish 20 feet down. Oh, why didn't she turn automatically? That's what you're supposed to do. All right, y'all, off the island, and we made it to uh, this first little point. Crank time. Oh, there we go. Right off the dock, y'all. First fish. No way. <laughs> That's on the crankbait. All right. Nice. Got us one, Finn. Let's go. There we go, y'all. That's on the shiver crank from Carl's Bait and Tackle. Heck yes. I would say it's probably a 7 to 10 foot diver first fish in the boat the island that we started fishing when we first got here is literally right out there and uh, this is the first little marina on the way in uh, we just tossed that fish in the live well momentarily for some photos and everything but the spot lock is acting up this Garmin man I'm telling you it just likes to cut to the left and to the right at full power out of nowhere so you got to be very careful make sure you got your sea legs ready but check this place out y'all I mean it's like 15 feet down maybe more I mean look at this I'm I bet you people are fishing those trees sometimes Look at that boat ramp. It's not even in the water. And that thing is like, that's a mega ramp right there. <laughs> that's a lengthy boat ramp. So Travis is down quite a bit. And it looks like these fish might be moving up eight foot dev. Let's get some lines back in the water, see if we can get some more. We're gonna let our first catch of the Austin trip go. First day out here on Lake Travis. What a start, we'll see you there. Day two, Austin, Texas. Just make sure this thing's been charging all night. All right, we're green. Had to borrow a little bit of the hotel's power. We didn't have much luck like right there at the mouth and we kind of went back but uh we got some buddies around i think we're gonna go hit up ladybird yeah all right y'all we're out here with jared on ladybird he's throwing the ghost devin's throwing the jackal gantrell jr a lot of swim baits by the way jared now holds the world record for amount of days fished consecutively in a row and he's at 783 you're not stopping at 800 either huh i don't think i'm gonna he doesn't think he wants to stop. Would it be crazy to have him fish a thousand days in a row? Y'all gotta check him out. 
Anyways, lines in. Quit lying. Yeah. On the, is that the Gantarelle too? It is, and it's like the tiniest, it's the tiniest fish. fish. Oh my gosh, <laughs> would you believe it? All right, hold on. We got to get this oh, on. On the big tiny. camera, they wouldn't believe it. Talk about these fish being timid of big baits. This is a pretty good indicator that <laughs> If they're hungry, they're going after it. <laughs> That's so funny. So just to compare, here's what Jared's uh, not just throwing, but actually catching fish on out here. Compared to Devin's actual catch. <laughs> That's hilarious. Isn't that cute? <laughs> <laughs> so there you go. Little one's back in the water, y'all. First thing to get bit is the blue gill swim bait. Y'all know where to grab it. Check the description. Anyways, let's keep fishing. There Third. we go. Second fish in the boat. Literally just saw it jumping right there by the bridge, just blowing up on some bait, and boom, swung after it, making it look easy. You're above him. Is that you, or is that another fish? Right. Get right right ready to. Yep. Just a little. Oh, got him. Got him. Yep. I got treble hooks. Oh, nice. That. Uh, I can't tell yet. It's not. It's not huge. Either that or it's just playing. Yeah, I got it. We'll flip it. So we're all on the board now. Holy smokes. All right, y'all. First fish under first bridge. How about that? I think we are all on the board now. It's one to one to one. I might even have the biggest fish. I don't know, Jared, what do you think? This is a nice fish, <laughs> you know? You serious? We in the lead out here, y'all, on the crank baits. It seems like moving baits is the way to go, y'all. Let's see if we can keep cranking them, but upsize on the, uh, you know, length, weight, the whole nine. Put the bubble on. What, that's sick, holy shit. Yeah, yeah, dude, it's crazy, right? On the right? iPhone? Yeah, so it's like you get the over under, like the partially over there and partially under the water with the dome. Ooh. Got one, got one. Ooh. Oh, this is a good one. It, well, better, it better. might be good. It's tough to say. Better. Good? Nah. We'll have some fun with it. It's good? I'm on the BFS. Ooh. There we go. Sure you don't want the net? No, we're good. We're good. We're good. Oh! Ooh. Don't come in that trolley motor. No, 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 no. Oh, don't oh, come oh. Come in that trolley motor. Come here, boy. <laughs> what do we got here? Wow, this thing is going. There's more right below us, too. BFS reel, Ned Rig, Saucy Swimmer. Come here, baby. Come here, come here. That was a fight, dudes. Ah. <laughs> yeah. Nice. Wow. You break out that BFS reel and you have some fun, man. This is like eight pound floral carbon. Look at that little saucy swimmer. These on an A-rig is what John just caught that 14 pounder on. Tell you what, the fish are after these little baits. Second one in the city on Ladybird cranking them, boys. Let's see if we can get some more over here. We literally just switched spots, came out uh, from underneath the bridge after Jared said, I see some fish busting right here off this point. <laughs> and uh, bada bing, bada boom. All right, let's get some more. All right, if anything, oh, there it is, there it is. Go, 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 go. You might be able to make that cast. Got him? Yeah. Nice, BFS, let's go. Devin's hooked up, Baby Saucy Swimmer, same thing, but she's doing the shad color. It is a white bass. It's a white bass. That's what we're seeing all schooling. That's what's busting, too. Multi-species day. I like it. I was like, I'm not feeling weird head shakes. What is happening? Can't do this. <laughs> <laughs> I'm like struggling so hard. Really light light. Stop it. <laughs> Finally. <sighs> nice one though. That's nice. sick. Right? Slab white bass. He hammered it. We've been seeing these guys blowing up all over. That's fish number two for me. Let's get him in the water. Oh yeah. You're uh, angry. Yeah, they take off those You're things. You're angry, dude. Sick. That's five, six total now. Let's go. Another one. On the net? Yeah. Yeah. Baby sauce. He demolished that. It's like... <laughs> oh, well, the accidental release. When I got hit was when I was doing absolutely nothing. It was just sinking. How's my mustache? Flawless. Good. <laughs> they might. Oh, got him. Okay. Right Crank up the drag. Bank. Right off the bank, dude. As soon as it landed. Saucy. Yep. Yep. Ned. Ned sauce. Yeah, Ned sauce. He's fighting, but it's a little fish. Oh no, no, it's not that bad. <laughs> He's not that bad. <laughs> we'll take it. <laughs> he might be two to three pounds. Smoked it, dude. Yeah. Jeez. That's a pretty fish. Let's go. Another one on the sauce. They're absolutely crushing it. Biggest one of the day. Right off the banks over here. We got people just hanging out in the park, doing some CrossFit calisthenics and whatnot. And Jay's rolling up. Okay. See you, bud. Cruising. Jay Gone Fishing is in the house. Hey. What's up? Oh. Ah. Jared, living life. We're playing, Jay. Here they are. Oh, we'll get... oh, there goes a big He was ripping through here.
got the chauffeur. Jay going fishing up oh. front, working the trolling motor. Paradise on Earth, baby. I already told him I have the Garmin remote. We could just have the, we could just be playing video games and like trolling around these kayakers on the remote if we wanted to. But he insists on working the foot pedal. He wants to view the live scope that's no longer on screen because our boat has no power. Oh, there's, one. there's some grass. <laughs> and we're just thinking to ourselves, we could really use some new batteries. Does anybody have the hookup on some lighter weight, more powerful batteries? And he's making it sound like maybe they've just been, they've just lived a full life. I feel like no, because we haven't had this thing that long, but maybe, I, I guess we have. So you buy three new batteries a year, basically, like every four. Yeah, he's powering that big thing. <laughs> Did we get any fish in the boat since you have been on the boat? Zero. Yeah. Just the one that came off the hook. We've seen fish. And we met a lot of homies today, y'all. It's pretty crazy, but so many folks on kayaks are out here fishing today. It's like 80 degrees President's Day, by the way. That's why you've seen so much action on the water. And we're just gonna try and make it all the way back to 35 Bridge Ramp, upwind, with the trolling motor battery we have left. So wish us luck. Well, y'all, we made it. That is gonna wrap up day two down here in Austin. We might hit some new lakes tomorrow. Stay tuned. We're also gonna make sure to charge the boat fully overnight and uh, see if it uh, can get us through the majority of tomorrow's fishing festivity. So we'll catch y'all then. Awesome day out with Jay and Jared for day two. We'll see y'all on day three. It's time to go grab some dinner, y'all. Let's get the tamale packed up. Here, you want me to get the... Oh, that's something right there, boys. Wow, blazing worm. That's big. It's big. Nope. Here. <laughs> wow! Oh man! Found us a little fatty! <laughs>